How's it going guys? It's Josh here. I don't know what my intro is yet. Should it be that or, or that? It's like a new dance move, isn't it? I don't know, let me know in the comments. How's it going guys? My name's Josh and today I'm going to try and help you with a bit of a problem that you may have had. Now the problem comes down to this question. Can you run dual monitors off of your graphics card and internal graphics at the same time? Now I'm just going to go ahead and answer this question straight away. The answer is yes. But why would you even want to do that? Well, let me give you a scenario. So the scenario goes like this. You've got a monitor currently, and you've got a HDMI cable running from your graphics card to your monitor. Everything's working fine. But then you decide to pick up another monitor, or you may have decided to pick up a TV, and you want to run dual monitors, because you think it's cool. And it is cool. So, you go and grab another HDMI cable. You go to plug it into your graphics card, and there's only one HDMI output. The rest are display ports. Now you could go and buy a DisplayPort to HDMI adapter, but they're expensive for no reason. And also your, your, your monitor, it, it only has HDMI. So then you look on the back of your motherboard, you think, right, well I've got a HDMI output on there, I'll just shove it in there, that should work, shouldn't it? So you go and do that, but then to no avail, it doesn't work, you don't get any output on the second, the second monitor. Now, there is a way around this, and it's very simple, it should take like 30 seconds to show you, so we're going to do that now. Right then guys, here's what you're going to do, you're going to come down to your computer right here, you're going to press the reset button. I mean, you could just restart your computer, but that'd be too easy, wouldn't it? And then you're going to wait for the screen to come on, and when you see this menu, you're going to hit the delete button, just press it lots of times, doesn't matter how many times you press it, as long as you press it. Um, okay, and now we have entered the BIOS, the, the very scary BIOS. All you need to do now, go across to chipset, which is obviously referring to your onboard kind of graphics and stuff. Go to internal graphics, and you'll see that this will be disabled, okay? And that's the reason why your dual monitor output is not working, because this will be disabled. When you install a new graphics card, guys, it automatically disables this, because your computer thinks, well, you're not going to want to use both, are you? Which is probably correct but in this case we do so we're gonna go ahead and enable it then all you need to do save and exit like that and then if I go over to my second monitor now I'm just gonna cut this part because um, it it takes a little while hey and there we go it's working yeah, so that's it pretty much guys, um, simple as that. Just two things to mention real quick, you're probably going to have a different motherboard and process to me, so your BIOS is going to look a little bit different. All that aside though, you're still looking for internal graphics and you, you're trying to enable them. Just look in the BIOS somewhere guys, it will definitely be there. Um, the second thing is, obviously when you're logged in and everything, just go to your home screen, right click and go to display settings and just decide whether you want to extend the displays or duplicate them and obviously just make sure that the second display is actually detected. Um, yeah, and that's and that's that sorted. Hopefully this video has helped some of you. I know I looked on YouTube before um, for, for a video like this and there wasn't really one out there. So yeah, hopefully it's offered you some of you some help and sort of solved that problem for you. Um, if you liked it guys, leave a like, that'd be awesome. See if we can get to 10 likes, that would be great. Um, and subscribe as well, I'll try and bring you lots more kind of tips and tricks like this. So yeah, stay tuned guys. And uh, yeah, after all that, I'll see you in the next video.